Testing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got a new mic, no longer two mic Kaylee, more like multiple mic Kaylee. I have this mic that goes right here on the shirt. So I went to New York City this past weekend. Uh, it was fun, I blogged it. Here's that vlog for you all. I love you all. I think I have more to say, but I don't remember. Bye. Ready? Going to NYC. Why is this so zoomed in? No, it's more. I'm looking good. I'm gonna miss you! Oh my! Oh my! Oh my goodness! Irritating. Irritating. Twins be like. My mom gave me these, and wow, I'm looking real. Looking real nice. Oh wow, he's a stunner. You're so pretty. Our flight was delayed an hour and 15. Okay, I gotta talk louder. This camera is. I know. You put subtitles. Our flight was. <laughs> Our flight was delayed an hour and 15 minutes and there's something on my mouth. That's gross. Whatever I wiped away on my lip ended up being on the side of my face in the next clip. So you can call me disgusting and gross because it's acceptable. We shoveled food into our mouth thinking that we were going to board and then we didn't. So there's that. But we have a cute view of the airport. So, oh, a plane. So because our flight was delayed, we were getting super tired. So Azure went and got us some latte from a place at the airport. And bitch, when I tell you this was the nastiest latte I've ever had in my life, I don't even think it had coffee in it. I think it was just frothed milk. It was un it was undrinkable. I want to introduce you guys to a few people. You guys know Azure. She's one of my best friends from high school. We booked this trip together. But you guys probably don't know Elena, who was another best friend from high school, who went to college in Long Island and then got a job in Manhattan. She currently lives in Queens, which is where we're staying for this trip. And that's my friends, yeah. Here is me stunting and slaying with my makeup done. And Elena straightened my hair for the first time in years and put it up in a high pony. Bitch, can't clock me. Azure, what did you just win? <gasps> a booby! Yay! It's a, it's a stress booby. It's a stress booby. We're getting best friend forever. Do you take this person <gasps> to be your very best friend? <laughs> we I, I do. Press one for I do. <laughs> Press. Press two to escape. <laughs> and do you also take this person to be your very best friend to have and to cherish forever from this day to escape? Please collect your rooms below. Thank you. You have exchanged these rooms as a flat of your. <laughs> <laughs> oh okay, there we go. Oh my god, we've been wed. She Love it. Yes.
And then later in the day, we met up with some of Elena's friends from college for a little happy hour. And then we met up with Shannon, one of Elena's good friends who I've become friends with from her college. And she's really cool. Just watch, like she's awesome. Yeah, she's like the second coolest person I know besides me. We went to a couple places and bitch, I got fogged up. I got fogged up. For dinner, we went to this place in Koreatown and holy shit, we grubbed so mother freaking hard. How many of y'all want to go to the pub break one to visit one of the cup? What up everyone, it is day two of New York City trip. I am living life. Elena is truly NYC. Look at all that. God, she's so New York. Oh, my oh, yep, she got, she was a... <laughs> I forgot about that, here come that boy. And it tasted just like it So for day two, we went to this little spot in Brooklyn called Smorgasburg. Actually, it wasn't little. There was like a million people there, but it's basically this food vendor place where you can get a million different types of food. Azure got this delicious looking egg sandwich and obviously she liked it. Whoa. Elena got this calamari stuff. And then I really wanted to find some good ass vegan food. So there's this vegan deli booth there that had like vegan pastrami and that shit was so good. I was quaking. And then I met up with my friend Jenny from SCAD. And we got these like Cuban bowls and they were so good. And then we sort of just walked around Brooklyn and had a time. It was great. We are sitting at some outside um, thing, like this is like bar, and we're waiting to go to another bar to open. I know I haven't like really been talking this whole time, but been sort of taking in this city. Oh my god, you are so somber. Okay, so we really wanted to go to this one wine bar, but it's closed. So we're literally sitting on the side of the street trying to figure out what we're gonna eat, and we're gonna go to this German place that has pretzels and French fries. Oh, this looks so nice. We're going. Are you ready? Let's go. Yes. What up guys? I just wanna let you know I vape now. It's called a Surin Drop. Um So funny story, we walked to this place called Juice Press and I really wanted a coffee or some kind of smoothie and I saw this place had wellness shots so I got this like ginger, turmeric, cayenne one, didn't really think much of it. Took the shot and literally died. It was the worst thing I'd ever consumed in my entire life. You can literally see me sweating right after the shot. It was so awful. I felt my body start to disintegrate. My life flashed before my eyes. I could not breathe. It was the most awful shock to my system in the world. I do not recommend this. If you see a cayenne shot, don't take it. Just I. I almost died. So while we were eating our food at By Chloe, the restaurant that you just saw a montage of, I had this idea. I'm like, I'm in New York, I'm young, I'm fresh, I got nothing to do. Let's get a tattoo. So I had the idea where I would ask my subscribers. I sent out a story saying, can, can one of you DM me the YouTube play buttons? And I didn't really say why. I was gonna like make it a surprise because I wanted to get a tattoo of it made by one of you, like hand drawn by one of you. So I was really excited about that. So Azure finds this shop. We go into it. It's real nice and fancy. Online, we saw that the minimum was $85. We walk in and the lady goes, the first thing she says is, <laughs> she saw that we were dusty. I was like, hey, I want to get a tattoo. And she was like, she's like, okay, um, the minimum is $300. And I was like, <laughs> uh -huh. 
Oh, what? The look of someone who had to leave a tattoo shop because the minimum was too high. I look like I just jumped in the pool. Slay bitch. <coughs> Slay bitch. Jumping in pool realness. Baby hairs flying. NYC ready.